Hello everyone! In this video I will show you how to make an enemy fire bullets towards player's position. So which bullet is emitted in direction of current player's coordinates? Scripts will be available by the link in the description. Here is our scene with only two game objects. First one is a cat. Our cat has rigid body to the component with gravity scale set to zero and collision detection set to continuous. Also it has circle collider 2D, which is a trigger to detect collisions with bullets. Last component is cat script that helps us to move a cat with arrow buttons. Here it is. Here we have move speed variable that can be set in inspector. Direction X and direction Y variables that will hold movement directions. And rigid body 2D reference that is assigned in start method. In update method we read input values from arrow keys and assign them to direction X and direction Y variables multiplied by move speed. And in fixed update method, we move a cat by setting a velocity to rigid body to the component according to direction values. That's the cat. Next game object is a monster that fires bullets to the cat. It's just static game object with monster script attached, which has prefab slot to instantiate bullets. Here is the monster script. First of all, here is bullet game objects variable that we can assign in inspector. Next two variables are fire rate and next fire that allows us to fire bullets every one second. In update method, we invoke check if time to fire method. So if current time greater than next fire value, then we instantiate a bullet at monster's position and reset next fire variable, so next instantiation will be allowed after one second. That's the script. As I said, here is a prefab slot that contains bullet reference. Let's take a look at bullet prefab. This game object has rigid body to the component with gravity scale set to zero and collision detection set to continuous. Also it has circle collider 2D which is a trigger to detect collisions with other game objects, with the cat in our case. And it has bullet script that controls bullet's behavior. Here is this script. Here we have move speed variable, rigid body reference, target variable with type of cat and vector to move direction variable that will represent direction to target. So in start method we assign rigid body variable first. Then we assign target variable, finding our cat game object by its type which is cat. After that we calculate direction to target by subtraction target position and bullet position. Resulting vector is normalized and multiplied by move speed. Then we set a velocity to bullet's rigid body component according to calculated direction to target. If bullet doesn't meet any game object to collide with, then it will be destroyed in 3 seconds to keep the scene clear. And if bullet collides with some game object, then we check if it's a cat and if it is, then we just send the message to console and destroy bullet game object. That's it. Let's hit play and see how it works. Bullets are spawned every 1 second by the monster. We can control the cat by arrow keys to avoid those bullets. And if bullet hits the cat, then hit message is sent to console and bullet is destroyed. Hope you like this tutorial, thank you for watching, see you next time.